Crystal one. It is all the conservative coin collector. And if you've been watching my channel for any length of time, you'll know that I not only collect coins, but I collect dollar bills as well. I started off just doing coins, but then dollar bills became ex more interesting to me, and then now I collect the whole gamut. So, what uh, do you look for when collecting dollar bills? There's a lot you can look for, but one thing that dollar bill collectors like to look for are cool serial numbers. What are some cool serial numbers to look out for? I'm going to tell you. As for today's video, is going to be cool serial numbers to look out for while dollar bill hunting if you can afford it, of course. Let's get on to the video. I don't want to make this intro too much longer. So with that being said, you know, like, comment, subscribe, and share. And well, out of the video. Hi. It is I, Conservative Coin Collection from the Future. And uh, you may notice on the first one, there's this horrible uh, noise on the uh, first clip. That is my laptop fan. I can't fix it. And if I would record it, I couldn't, it will make the same horrible loud noise. I figure out how to fix it on clip two, but if you hear a horrible screech, it's my laptop fan. Sorry in advance. The first type of serial number to look out for is something called a low serial number. Collectors love dollar bills with low serial numbers, such as those below a thousand or even a hundred. These kinds of bills can sell anywhere from a Ten to three hundred dollars. The lower the number, the more valuable the currency is considered to be. A dollar bill with a serial number zero 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 one could be worth fifteen thousand dollars, according to SavingAdvice.com. The second type to look for are on the opposite side of the spectrum: high number serial notes. People also enjoy collecting currency with high numbers, and this can even be more valuable than lower numbers because there are fewer in circulation. Bills marked with 999-99900 are especially prized. The third kind is a flipper. A flipper is a note whose serial number can be read right side up or upside down. It has to have a combination of zeros, sixes, nines, and eights. On eBay, flippers can cost a few bucks or several hundred dollars, and it depends on how that auction site is feeling. The fourth type of dollar bill is what I've talked about on my channel a million times, Star Notes. Some bills have a star instead of a letter at the end of the serial number. These star note bills are replacements issued when the original bill had a printing error because it's against policy to produce the dollar bill serial number twice. The mint simply adds a star to the end of it. There are dollar bills that are known as repeaters and super repeaters. The dollar bill I'm showing you is just a regular repeater. It has a block of numbers that are the same. 262626. Two, six, two, six. But to be a super repeater, they'd have to be a 2 and a 6 on the whole serial number. Instead of just the middle of the, uh, the dollar bill. So it's a near super repeater. These super repeaters can be a few hundred dollars on some eBay listings. Solids and near solids. A solid serial number is one where every digit is the same. Take for example the one that I'm showing you that's all eights. One out of every 11 million notes is a super solid. And uh, it could be worth $500 or more. Some super rare ones are listed on eBay for thousands of dollars. These are so rare that people also collect near solids where only one digit suffers. Like take for example, if this note had a seven in the middle of it, instead of it being all eights. It's burned less money, but 
they, uh, they, uh, you're more likely to find one in there, bring less money, but it's still decent. Binary bills. Binary bills have serial numbers with only two numbers in their serial number. A near solid would count as one of these binary notes since it only includes two numbers. One of these on eBay can go for more than uh, $300. Of course, eBay being an auction site doesn't necessarily reflect the true value of these dollar bills, but it's pretty cool. Trinary bills. I also want to mention that these dollar bills can also have a star at the end of them. So if you find, for example, a trinary bill with a star at the end of it, that makes it even more valuable. But uh, what these are, are trinaries that contain three unique digits in various combinations. They typically sell for a few dollars on eBay, although there are some that are listed for several hundred dollars. Letter bills. When a serial number ascends or descends in order, in numerical order, like 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, or 8, 7, 6, 7, 4, 3, 2, 1, collectors call it a ladder. You can also find near ladders where one or two digits break it up. Ladder notes can sell from anywhere from $9 to as much as 100000 Number 10, birthday notes. Some collectors want a note with a specific year or date on the serial number. Perhaps a famous date or one meaningful to them. A birthday note is a serial number that just so happens to uh, have it on there. Take for example this bill that I found, 0407-1940. That could be somebody's grandma or grandpa's birthday. Or their birthday if they collect, and they just so happen to be an older person. Radar and Super Radar Dollar Bills A radar serial number reads the exact same backwards and forwards, like a palindrome for example. A good condition, uncirculated $1 radar note could sell for about $25, or even more for, even more than that, for 100 if only the two end digits are different, you have a super radar, which is much more rare and valuable. Even a $1 bill with this type of serial number can sell for up to $129. Consecutive dollar bills are actually very cool. When you have two or more separate notes with consecutive serial numbers, they are, uh, you can have serial numbers like the ones that I'm uh, showing you up here. They are not uncommon. In fact, it is way more common to get consecutives if you get a brand new stack of dollar bills from the bank. Consecutives can sell for as little as a few dollars or for as much as a few hundred. They are not uncommon. Lucky number 13 is the last dollar bill I have for you. It's called... Book bend serial numbers. Book bends happen when the serial number has the same two or three digits on both ends. It's called a book bend. Three number book bends are more valuable than two digit book bends. They can start for around $3 for a $1 book bend on eBay. 